Tyler. Sunderland are in the red and white stripes. And here's Arnott once more. Raul brought down by Harris. And here's a free kick. And Sunderland continue to carry the fight to Leeds United. Is Holden. Ah, oh, not again. Now Holden just ran away from him. It's Mel Holden's jumping that put McQueen under pressure to start with, turned back by Arnott. And it just bobbled away from Mel Holden. Curry now. This break for Leeds and Cherry. Now Frank Gray. Precious few shots from Leeds United. This time Frank Gray coming up, actually on an overlap, and putting it wide. Adley's header. Gray. Managing. Towers picking it up again for Sunderland. Finding Arnott. Turning it in for Lee coming in. And now Lee blocked on the line. Was it a penalty? No. The referee indicating it was Paul Reedy's chest. And Bob Lee can't believe it. A lovely ball initially from Towers. Turned in by Arnott. And Stewart couldn't hold it under pressure from Lee, and Lee reacted so quickly, and it was certainly the stomach of Paul Rini that stopped Sunderland. Arnott. Forward again, first time from Towers. Lee stretching, and so is McQueen. It's a Sunderland throw. from Hampton. Now Holden. Now wanting some help. And finding uh, he can't get round Hampton. He gets it back and gets a corner. Persistent play from Holden, keeping Leeds under the cosh a little bit. And certainly territorially, Sunderland have dominated the second half. Apart from the one scare when Peter Lorimer broke. Doherty leaving the corner for Arnott. Cut out by Frank Gray. Now Doherty for Arnott. Doherty going on. Trying to get it back. And they've all missed it. And at the far post, Bob Lee hasn't. And it's no more than Sunderland deserve. But all credit to Mick Doherty. Tony Curry had to let him go. It would have been a penalty otherwise. And they were queuing up in the middle. Holden was there, went across past Elliott, but Bob Lee didn't miss. Well, he's had a controversial time, Bob Lee, since uh, Sunderland paid so much money for him. But he's found his goal touch in recent weeks. Now Carl Harris. Well, Sunderland nearly caught so cold. Harris completely in. And if Bob Lee's goal is going to prove valuable for Sunderland, this save might be priceless. Dave Merrington, the assistant manager there in the glasses. A tense time for him now. Mike Anderson, the substitute, on the right of the picture. He's saying 10 minutes, but there's considerably more than that to play. About 18 minutes to go.
Maidley. Sunderland pushing out. And McQueen making the break. And McQueen going on. But it won't count. Because see, the flag had been up against McQueen for offside. So much ado about nothing. Holden. Elliot. Or will this goal spur leads to some sort of action? Because really, it's been a very lacklustre performance from them. Now Rini. Harris. Sliding it in for Rini for Cherry. 1-1. So indeed, they do bounce back. And Sunderland, who had done the difficult thing, had got in front, are punished by Trevor Cherry there.